Hello there, my fellow brick stackers. This is Chris, and I'm coming to you with another Lego haul today. This should be Lego haul 55. And if I'm not mistaken, this is the Lego haul from Brick Stacking in the Wild number 10, I believe. Um, it's been sitting here in the corner for a little while, and I can't remember when, but I think that's it. Now, a few things in here aren't Lego, but I'm going to show them to you anyway. Uh, first thing is, you know, I start off, I got this shirt, and uh, I got this awesome shirt. Okay, it says, uh, trust me, I'm a superhero. That's what it says. Yeah. All right, as you know, I'm a superhero fan, a little fanatic in Star Wars shirt here. I like these shirts. They're so comfortable for like 12 bucks at Target. Can't beat it. Red Star Wars shirt. So, you got me three shirts to start off with, and I'll show you all this other stuff that isn't Lego first. Picked up on clearance at Target two of the Target exclusive Star Wars mini, uh, action figure sets. And one's got Darth Vader and Anakin in it, and this one's got Darth Maul and uh, Darth Sidious. I got these for my boy for his birthday also. Um, this is my copy, but he got a cut. He got some. Else. He loves them. He been playing with them since I gave them to him. So, and the rest of this is Lego, I believe. All right. As you know, uh, I went on a s Saturday and uh, went to several targets, and pretty much everything was picked over as far as the clearance because they marked them down on Thursday. So what I'm showing you is just the leftovers. But paid. Hey, Two dollars and ninety-eight cents for two more, or two ninety-eight each from two more of Mia's magic tricks. Uh, as you can see in the back, I think you can see it. Uh, all that pink right there, half of it's Mia, and the other one's that karate class one that, that's out there in France. So I got, I already parted out like, I don't know, six, seven of these things already, uh, and that's the rest of them that I've got to part out in that massive stack right there. Now I'm not clutch stack size yet, but you know I got stack here. I've got a shelf full over here, and then I've got multiple shelves over here in the corner. So I have a lot to do. So two of those. This was an online return. If you've been following me on Instagram, you've seen all this. I post a lot of what I buy as I'm buying it online in my uh, Instagram feed. So follow me at BritStackers on Instagram if you've got it. And we do share a lot. The YouTube community, you guys, we do a lot of Lego uh, pictures. So sh check that out. This was a online return, and I got it for five dollars, five dollars and six cents to be exact. Uh, I don't think I have this one, thirty-eight fifty-nine and thirty-eight fifty-eight. No, I don't have this one, thirty-eight fifty-nine. I've got another one, but I'll sit down one day and just pour it out. I got like one of each one of these. I just find them at random. There's a pirate one up there and all kind of stuff. These little board games have some good tiles in them. So, one of those, and then I picked up another one of these Crater Creepers. Uh, it was not $16. It was half price. It was like um, $9.99. So, the sticker must have been left over from They missed marking it down again. But, uh, you know, it's 50% off, so I went ahead and got that one. And then the other target I went to, I scored probably my best score of this current clearance deal. Uh... I'm having the box right there. But anyway, the box is all damaged on the back. I don't know if I did that. I don't recognize it as being there when I bought it. But box is not in perfect condition anyway. It's got shelf wear. All right, this is 9467, the Ghost Train. I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. Probably going to keep it for myself. Um, I like the trains. I think it's something that's becoming more rare as we go along with LEGO. Uh, I hope they do not cut back too much on their trains. But... I think I'm probably going to keep this and build it myself since I only have one and I only paid $39 for it. It's an $80 set. It's 50% off. And the bad thing is, is I was watching this one at my local uh, 30 miles away at a Walmart. They had like four of them sitting on the shelf for $70. And uh, I was like $69.99. And I was like, man, I've got to wait. And then it went down to 54 And I said, well, nobody's touched them in two or three months. I said, nobody's going to buy them here because they don't move a lot of Lego in that store. And lo and behold, I went the other day and they were all gone. So, anyway, I'll probably keep this one for myself and build it. And that's it, I believe, for this one. So, yeah, 
that's it and the next haul i'll show you what i picked up on the next day's uh lego haul when we went to a different town and um it was in the same video on um, brick stacking in the wild so uh check me out on instagram if you don't mind subscribe comment share here like our videos please or my videos check me out on check me out on bricklink and brick isle and until next time guys y'all continue to stack those bricks see y'all